because there's never been a successful matriarchy in the history of humanity. No, there's not true. What about England? England, no, Queen no. Queen Victoria. Having a female in charge is different than a matriarchy. When I talk about matriarchy, I mean on average in the household, the man was in charge. On average, men were in charge of the society. On average, you could have a female head of state, but on average, it was the men who were ruling society. The men were in charge of working and providing. Women yeah, no, the women the were house, listening though. to the men on average. Right, that's right. my point. On average, right, right. right? So I've I've had this argument with a feminist before. She's like, oh well, we we've never tried matriarchies. We've only tried patriarchies. Blah blah blah. And I said, listen, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> this feminist is saying to me, oh yeah, but we've never tried a matriarchy. I said, no, I'm sure it's been tried. The problem is it's very, very difficult to survive under a matriarchy. It's not the natural gender roles. And the matriarchies that did exist in humanity, I'm sure they existed. The reason we don't discuss them is they never even got a chance to create any history because they were fucking decimated by the patriarchies. There is no, what is the statistical odds? Someone at home, some feminist, if you can do some fucking math, you bimbo, work this out. 